What's poppin? What's poppin? What's poppin? What's poppin? Hey, what's poppin? What's poppin? What's poppin? What's poppin? What's poppin? What's hey? What's poppin? What's poppin? What's hey? What's poppin? What's poppin? What up, y'all? I'm back with another video. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more of this face, honey. <laughs> right? Uh, we're going to do a makeup tutorial. I haven't done one in a very long time. So I decided, why not? I got some products from Lip Bar, and I wanted to try these products out. So, let's get right into the video. If I'm looking off, it's because I'm looking into... A mirror that's right there can't trust that at all or maybe I could just use this so I could be so I'm actually looking at y'all so what's good y'all what's goody goody what's goody goody so um while I'm doing this I guess I could talk to you guys about something that's on my mind so I tried um, dating apps like I was on meet black people meet black meet black I was gonna say meet black people meet black and then I was on um, Tinder and Bumble so Tinder I found out with Tinder most of those guys really just wanted like a hookup. They ain't want nothing too serious. So I decided to quickly get off of that. I mean, the app is still on my phone, but I just don't use it. Um, and then I, I tried, am I blurry? Am I in focus? Then I tried Bumble. And Bumble was cool but most most of the guys wasn't re like really what i was looking for what i was looking for and i didn't see too much of that to my liking um you know what i don't understand about apps is why do people post pics of like their chest off and that's how I know you really don't want nothing serious because if you, the first thing you think about doing is to post a picture of your body. Fam, what are you talking about? Like, come on, sis. And then uh, I tried, but then I kept Bumble because Bumble has like three um, departments. It's the meet, uh, like dating, finding a friend and um business a business section like you could network with people on that so i thought that was pretty genius so i kept that around um but i also met a few cool people off of the bumble friends department as well so that was pretty dope um So yeah, uh, then I used this app called Meet Black, and um, is this finished? Oh no, Meet Black, and I met a few people on that, a few hit or miss, a few people who said that they wanted something like serious or substantial, and then but then they were like moving too fast like wanted to come over by sis apartment like fam what no we didn't even go on a date what are you talking about like do i look dumb and then i met this one guy who was super nice like like super nice he was a foodie he has two kids um which i said i would never date a guy with kids again but um he just seemed really nice um so we started chatting on the app and then it transitioned to like the phone 
because both of us were barely on the app so we would send each other messages and it'll be like two days without responding because we hadn't even realized that the person had messaged so um yeah that was cool and then we hung out for like um a month and then he started acting weird like before I used to get like good mornings from him like all the time and then I barely would get anything and then when I would respond like when I would like text him he'd take like a year and a half before he responded which he never did before so it was really weird <sighs> so yeah I took that as like he's not interested anymore so I left that be um but he was cool cuz the good thing about that situation is just the fact that it let me realize that there are guys out there who do like the things that I like like he he opened the door for me like the car door everything he, he wouldn't let me touch the door um he was a foodie like I said so he enjoyed trying like different restaurants and you know yeah he liked to travel he was more into traveling which was pretty dope and i felt like i couldn't find anybody kind of like into what i'm into uh, i was like i almost the last couple people that i've been with um i almost had to like force them to do the things that i like so it was refreshing to find somebody out there who kind of likes the stuff that I like so it was a little disappointing that it in like a month it went sideways but I kind of knew like something like that would happen because when we talked about signs like uh, astrological signs he kept saying stuff like yeah um, my ex-wife was a Gemini which I'm a Gemini and how he always seems to hook up with Gemini's but he always like has a problem with Gemini's and then he also stated like um the last few people that he's dated it kind of didn't even last long so you kind of thought maybe it was his track record and not so much the ladies so then after a month hit and then he starts acting weird with me it's almost like that's what he does like after a month i'm ready to move on so but long story short the 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 good thing about it is is the fact that i was able to see that there are guys out there um who are into what i'm into and could respect me enough to like do simple things like open the door and text me first thing in the morning without me without me messaging them um so that was good i i i am grateful to have met him for that uh, purpose in its entirety do i feel like i want to continue with online dating i <laughs> I feel hmm I feel a little wary about it because of like the stuff that I went through with a couple of those sites I feel but my thing too is that like I'm focused on business and building my brand and becoming full-time at what I'm doing that I really don't have the time to like go out and meet people like randomly so I feel like maybe apps are probably the best thing for me but then I don't want to do I don't, so I don't even know um I don't know there's this one guy that I've been seeing or talking to now going on a year but um he uh 
stated from the beginning that he didn't want a relationship. I'm not gonna put any powder on my face because it's hot as balls outside. Um, he didn't want a relationship and yeah, he just was just like chilling. But we've been spending so much time together. Um, so it's going, it's, 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 I don't know how to say it. It's interesting to see what will happen between the two of us because of what he stated he wasn't looking for, but it's basically what we're doing. Um, yeah. Dating is hard, y'all. Like, I don't know how people do. Okay, so before I get anything started, this is the LA, I mean, the Lip Bar Fresh Glow Bronzer and Blush Duo. This is in Sleeping In and Bubble Bath. I'm using the Sleeping In to bronze my face, but also I'm gonna use it on my eyelids. So that's what I'm using right now. This is the color, it's super pretty. Um, just gonna dust that on my eye and I kind of like sweep it down my nose and then from the Carly Bible B and BH Cosmetics collab, the 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 highlight that I use is normally this. I'm just gonna plop them on my eyelids. Take that same brush and just like blend it all out so I don't look too crazy. I just want a little glistening in the center. So yeah, um, I'm going into stuff now without expectations. I'm just having fun or just being happy. And while we're here, I'm just going to use it the same highlight to highlight my face. This is how I've been doing it. It just looks crazy in the beginning, but then I blend it all out. Boogers! <laughs> Boogers! I'll take this brush that I got off of Amazon and just blend. And then from the same like uh, duo from Lip Bar, I'm gonna use that pink shade, which is Bubble Bath, which is that. And I'm just gonna put that on the apples of my cheeks. Take that. I put it on my nose as well. Almost like you're blushing. I mean, when black people blush, do you really see it? <laughs> All right. Then some mascara. I need some new mascara. This is the Maybelline um, Colossal Big Shot.
Then the uh, lip bar, she gave me two um, options. She gave me the pencil, the lip pencil in I don't know the name of it. Straight Talk. And then the um, lipstick is in uh, Mochachito. I did a video with these before, but I didn't really like how the makeup look came out. I think I'm just going to use the... Let's see. Not on the teeth, darling. Yeah. The pencil broke. So let's put a dab of this in the center. So this is the final look sees. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed our little chit chat. If you ever tried online dating or app dating or whatever it's called, please let me know in the, um, the comments box, comment box below. If you have any dating ideas for your girl, let me know in the comment box below. All products that I use will be in the description box. And I hope to see you later. See you later, Tiger Lilies. Crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard.